Hi everyone, my name is Chris Rogers. I'm a senior technology evangelist here at Zerto. So I'm here to talk to you today about the Zerto Cyber Resilience Vault and the benefits it can bring to your organization. So firstly, let's talk about what is the Zerto Cyber Resilience Vault? Well, obviously in the title, it's there for cyber resilience. We're more focused on ransomware attacks. That's the main focus of this Cyber Resilience Vault. So what we're doing at Zerto is we're combining two technologies that are traditionally bought separately and used independently. So we're talking about a data vault and an isolated recovery environment or a clean room, as they're more commonly known. And what we're doing at Zerto is we're bringing those two technologies together to give you a data vault and an isolated recovery environment all in one pre-built bundled package for you. The packages are available in, as I said, pre-built sizes from small all the way up to extra large, depending on the size of your organization and your environment. So let's drill down and look what's inside the Zerto Cyber Resilience Vault. So for our networking, we're using HP Aruba networking. And then below that, to connect to our network, we're going to need some kind of compute to run our workloads once we actually get them up and running in our isolated recovery environment. So we're going to be using ProLiant for this. And then we need somewhere to store our data inside of our data vault. This sounds obvious, but in this instance, instead of using slow backup based or, or slow disk, we're actually using production grade Electra arrays. And then once we have all of that, we need a recovery mechanism to help you recover your data inside of your vault. So for obvious reasons, we're gonna be using Zerto in this instance. So now we know the components that go into our Zerto Cyber Resilience Vault. You can see that these are all production grade compute, network, storage, and the recovery mechanism is the fastest recovery experience out there. We've designed this on purpose to make sure that your recovery is as fast as it can possibly be. So that's our first benefit I'm gonna write up here, is the speed of recovery. We're looking at reducing the total ransomware impact from potentially days into weeks from what is on the market today down to only hours. Reducing that impact, reducing the time that your organization is down and reducing the chance you will have to pay that ransom. And then when we look at the other technologies, the other things that people are gonna need inside of a data vault, obvious one there is immutability. And the immutability here is provided by the HP Electra arrays. And the idea here is that no one can touch your data. So not only are they snapshots that are immutable, no one can touch them, no one can delete them, not even administrators, not even HP or Zerto themselves. They are locked away so no one can touch them. But also that because they're inside the vault, they're physically protected from the outside world as well. And that's the idea of, our, of, our, of another benefit we have here is that this is physically isolated from any production networks or production storage. So being isolated means that no one can get access to that. It's not on the network, it's not available, there isn't an, a, a firewall just allowing access in and out. It's physically isolated away, which provides our air gapping as well. These are all important technologies when we look at a data vault. This is our last resort of recovery. This is where every other technology, every other thing that we have to help us recover has not worked. So we are relying on this vault to be our last point of recovery. So it is important that it is secure, that we have a fast recovery experience because we've potentially already tried other recovery technologies that haven't worked, potentially wasting even more time. We need the data to be immutable, otherwise, What's the point of having a data vault if that data can be removed or deleted or even altered in any way? It's important to have an air gap inside of our environment to make sure those threat actors or bad actors who are inside our environment cannot get access to our vault. So having that physical air gap locked away means added security and known peace of mind for your environment. So let's recap the Zerto Cyber Resilience Vault. So inside the vault, we have HP Aruba networking, ProLiant for our compute, Electra for our storage, and Zerto as our primary recovery mechanism. That brings the benefits of the fast recovery, full immutability of your data, it's fully isolated and fully air-gapped 
in your environment, giving you the total peace of mind you can recover your data as fast as you possibly can from any type of ransomware attack. Thank you very much.